Right. So we are talking about the aspect of um, tumor size and lymph node stage of breast cancer. So I'm just trying to look at what, how you can use tumor size, like how big is a tumor. Then you're also trying to see that, okay, somebody has breast cancer, but are their lymph nodes affected? So you are trying to look at how can you use these two factors to be able to know which stage a breast cancer is at. Okay. So it's just useful in staging to um, breast cancers, right? We've already spoken about the staging. That's a TNM staging. The tumor, the T is tumor, the N is no doubt, that's nodes. The M is metastasis. So you use that to actually determine like how far a cancer has actually gone, right? So here's a summary. So tumor size, the determination of, uh, okay, sorry, the diameter of tumor has been used as an objective measurement, tumor size in different studies. So by convention and for comparative purposes, primary tumors are divided into three groups. So if you have the tumor size less than um, two centimeters, okay? If it's less than what? Two centimeters is T1, all right? So if it's two to five is what? T2. That's just what we're just trying to say. If it is what? More than five, you're talking about what? The tumor three. That's the third stage of the tumor, okay? How about the lymph nodes? Earlier studies were preoccupied with establishment of metastasis in lymph nodes, okay? So if you see that uh, no lymph nodes is what? Affected. That means what? Is N0. If it's just one to three lymph nodes affected, you are talking about N1, right? Uh, okay, one to three, one to three are here. Surgeon can feel lymph nodes. Uh, your lymph nodes feel swollen and lumpy. Okay, this one is basically like the stage, you understand? Like the staging, all right? So, you understand? This is just the if you have that uh, four and more, do you understand? So that's just it. So you can use tumors and what? Tu that's tumor size and what? Your lymph nodes, right? How many lymph nodes are affected and all of that. So you can actually use that as a basis of trying to know like the stage of a, a breast cancer. Like how far the breast cancer has actually gone. You understand? So that's just it, guys.